Welcome to this morning's edition of What's the Problem? Today we're talking about friends. So if you have a problem with one of your friends, call us now. And if you're listening to the program and you think you can help with any of the problems, just send an email to our website. Our email address is what.problem at radiotalk.com. Our first caller today is Barbara. Hello, Barbara. Hello. So, Barbara, what's the problem? Well, I have a problem with a friend called Jonathan. That's not his real name. Well, Jonathan often goes out with me and my friends. The problem is that he's really cheap. Cheap? Yes. He never pays for anything. When we have a drink, he always says he doesn't have any money or that he forgot to bring his wallet. So in the end, one of us always pays for him. At first, we thought, poor Jonathan, he doesn't have much money. But it's not true. His parents work, and he works on Saturdays in a store, so he must have some money. Do you think we should say something to him? Thanks, Barbara. I'm sure you'll soon get some emails with good advice. Okay, our next caller is Kevin. Hello, Kevin. Hi. What's the problem? Um, my problem is with my best friend. Well, the thing is, he's always flirting with my girlfriend. Whoa, your best friend flirts with your girlfriend? Yes. When the three of us are together, he always says things to my girlfriend like, Wow, you look fantastic today. Or, I love your dress, Suzanne. Things like that. And when we're at parties, he always asks her to dance. Well, do you think he's in love with your girlfriend? I don't know. But I'm really angry about it. What can I do? Well, let's see if one of our listeners can help, Kevin. And our last caller is Catherine. Okay, Catherine, over to you. What's the problem? Hello. I'm in college and I live on campus. I live in a dormitory and I share a room with a roommate. She's really nice. I get along very well with her, but there's one big problem. Mmm, what's that? Well, she always borrows things from me without telling me. Huh, what does she borrow? Well, first it was CDs and books, but then she started taking my clothes, too. Sweaters, jackets, and things. Yesterday, she took a white sweater of mine, and she didn't tell me. So when I wanted to wear it this afternoon, it was dirty. I don't want to lose her as a friend, but what should I do? Thank you, Catherine. So, if you can help Barbara, Kevin, or Catherine, email us at what.problem at radiotalk.com. All right, we're going to be right back after this.